Hey, Alfair Memoir Young here. Tonight I'm doing a short video on my writing routine. A lot of people have been asking me how I come up with my topics and how I um, just how I go about writing and how I um, what what my routine is. So just to keep it simple, for me, I can honestly write anywhere. <laughs> I've been at work on my lunch break before, sitting in my cubicle, working on a chapter. I think it's maybe having kids. I, I have some babies and, you know, I've learned to block them out. I and mean, then learning to block my babies out. You know, that sounds bad, right? And, they're learn and you know, when you're, the kids are squabbling or whatever, you, you learn as a mom to block all of that stuff out. So for me, I've learned to block all of everything out so if i'm at work in my cubicle and people around me talking i can block that out and write so i can pretty much write anywhere but my routine at home uh, before i get to, into my home routine this is what my best friend i have two phones and both of them are actually androids i've been wanting an iphone but i'm kind of in love with androids but anyway i this bad boy has so many notes in it for chapters and poems um i'm constantly in note in notepad just writing you know uh, when i'm at a restaurant if i think of something i'm pulling this phone out and i'm typing it up if i'm at work you know i've been in the middle of a meeting before and been like ding that light bulb goes off and i go let, let me get this out before I forget it because by the time the meeting's over, it, it's done. So, um, make your notepad in your phone your best friend when you're out in public. You know, when an idea comes to you, write it down immediately. You know, I find that I've, I've had over the years some really good ideas and then... I don't write them down and because I'm in a bad spot, I'm busy, um, in public, and by the time I get home and I try to think of it again, it's like, my gosh, it's gone. It's just gone. So, write your ideas down immediately, as soon as they come to you. Um, now, my writing routine at home... I try to choose an hour every single day to where I write something. Um, even if I pick up my laptop or pick up my phone and I'm just writing about nonsense, it, I'm writing. You know, um, I may not use that material ever or I may use it. And I also keep a, um, this sounds crazy, I keep all of my notes. Everything that I jot down because everything may be useful later. So there, there may be something in those notes that, you know, when you were just writing, just to be writing, that you can use later on. But I'm currently working on my fourth novel in my series, my Ocean View ser Ocean's View series. And um, I try to write at least an hour every day because I don't want to lose my mojo, lose the groove of what I'm doing with that novel. So I want to keep it fresh at all times. So I find an hour somewhere during throughout the day, no matter what to write. Now, when I decide to really get down and say, okay, it's time for me to buckle down and write, I find a quiet corner in my home, pull out my laptop and start typing away and usually for me my mind's always going you know all day long I'm thinking oh that would be good to put in my book what if she said and he said and he did and then he you know so I'm thinking like that all day about my project so always keep your project in mind keep it fresh in your head all day um but getting back to my routine I always find a quiet spot in my house to write, um, well, quite away from people. I can have music playing in the background or complete quiet. It just depends 
I'm I moved that day, but I cannot have the television going. I cannot have the television on because the voices, even though I can tune people out, the television bothers me. So I don't keep that on when I'm writing, but there are times I'll keep some music on, um, just depending on what my mood is. And for me, depending on what I'm listening to, that's my mood. So if I'm listening to some gangster rap, Man, this this better be a chapter where I'm talking about, you know, Ocean is about to run down. To, I mean, there, there's about to be some action going on. You know, if I if I'm writing a chapter where you know there's a little romance going on, you know, I may go all the way back to a little Marvin Gaye, or bring it back up to a little Tyrese, you know, or some Tony Braxton, or some um, gosh, what's that girl's name? Is it Ayala? Anyway, um, you, you, you get what I'm saying. So that's what I do. I find a quiet place, um, turn on some music, depending on the chapter that I'm writing, you know, it depends on the music that I play. And I'll just zone out and just write. You have to put everything else out here, okay? when you're writing and be right here with your with, with your writing. You have to be right here with it in order to get the best out of here and onto your laptop. Um, so that's pretty much my routine. Um, again, I write everywhere, everywhere. I can be in the grocery store and if an idea hits me, I have to stop and type it in my phone. Never, take the chance on forgetting a good idea. I always write it down immediately. So, yeah, that, that, that's pretty much it. This is nice and, nice and short, nice and sweet and to the point. Just, it, it, that's my routine. Finding a quiet spot in my house and just turning on some music and, and writing, going for it. But I would suggest that you write every single day. Um, even if you can't get an hour in, squeeze in 10 minutes. You never know what may come out of here, you know? You never know what's hiding in here until you start typing those words, you know? So try to spend no less than 10 to 15 minutes writing every day. You know, writing is like anything else. If you don't work on mastering that skill every single day you lose a piece of it every day you know it's like everything else if you you know let's say when i was younger i could draw okay just freehand and i stopped drawing after i had my babies and now that craft that talent i don't want to say it's no longer there but it's nothing like it used to be. Um, this painting up here, I did that. That's where I'm at now. I used to, I used to really be able to draw. Now I draw and paint like a five-year-old. But it's a hobby. Um, so take your writing seriously. Take it seriously. Try to master it by working on it every single day. So. Again, if you have any questions and comments, please leave them below. And please um, hit the thumbs up button. Please leave questions and comments below. And please go to Amazon or Barnes & Noble's website and put in my name, Tanya Young, T-O-N-Y-A, Young, Y-O-U-N-G, and check out my work. Now, we'll say it's easier if you go to Barnes & Noble's website, if you go to Barnes & Noble's website and um, type in my name, all of my work just pops up. It's a little harder to find me on Amazon. So check me out. Check out my um, Ocean View series. I'm working on book four in that series now. Um, I've been told the book's pretty hot. No, I haven't made the New York Times bestsellers list yet, but it's coming, people. It's coming. I have, I have faith in my craft okay it's coming so go check me out and um again if you ha have a nice little glass of wine tonight that's another thing okay I, oh wow <laughs> there's so much okay 
wait before I let you go. I, I did grab my glass of wine and I was getting ready to write what I thought about doing this video. There are times I will have me a nice little glass of wine before um, well, while I'm writing because it relaxes me and kind of you know, gets me in a groove, puts me in a different state of mind. So whatever you're into, wine, cold beer, <laughs> whatever, you know, vodka tonic, uh, have that, but make sure you're working on mastering your craft every single day. You don't want to lose it, you know? You don't want to lose it. Writing is a gift. So, it's been lovely, and I love to interact with you guys, so please leave questions and comments below so that I can respond as soon as I get those. And again, please thumbs up and hit the red button subscribing to my channel. Peace and blessings.